Hello and welcome. This is the Solaris X, and today I'm going to give you a fix to Rainbow Six Vegas and Rainbow Six Vegas 2 for the Xbox 360 wireless controller. Those of you that got the games on the PC and want to play on your wireless 360 controller, the download will be done in the description right by here. So just visit. The link right by there okay and you once you downloaded the, the file you come up with this ring raw file here and um, right click the ring raw and extract here you come up with this rainbow six xbox 360 wireless controller fixes double click this you come up with two photos number one photo and number two photo this represents the game so this will be rainbow six one this will be rainbow six vegas two so this is to fix the vegas two this is to fix vegas number one okay and go to the specified folder and here you'll find two fixes uh, double click one fix and here will be for the program files times 86 um, destination if your destination is not times 86 and is a 32 bit system what you do is just highlight the just go straight to the um, bracket right by there and get rid of the times 86 bracket until you reach to program files and install in this case I got times 86 so I double click here guys don't see that it's not working because it is because this is just a demonstration okay and click install install that fix will take you straight to the destination and um, would like to replace the file yes to all and fix two is for the rainbow six vegas one install click yes it will take you to that destination do i want to replace the item yes is working correctly just click on the thing rainbow six vegas 2 fix so just double click this thing here the same thing if it's on program files 32 bit system what you have to do is just remove this little line there and then press install in this case as always i am on times 86 so double click this and press install press yes and yes to install and now you have fixed the wireless controller for the um, Rainbow Six Vegas on PC on both Vegas 1 and 2 so now go to your game and go to options and select play with controller you should have no problem and all the buttons for the controller will be noted on the screen as well so i hope this helps take care good luck